Hey everybody, L here playing Kingdom Hearts Unchained Key. Today's video is a special episode featuring the most powerful and controversial thing in this game, and that is of course Mickey and Brooms, or MNB for short. Since MNBs are only available in the JP version for now, I wanted to make a video giving you guys my first hand experience with these and talk about what they mean for the game. If you're not familiar with Mickey and Brooms, this is a very special wildcard medal that you can use to add extra orbs and guilt any medal that you want without needing more copies of the same medal. These came out in the JP version fairly quickly after the game launched at just about 3-4 to four months in and they are easily the most powerful effect in the game because having access to MNB means you will only ever need just one copy of a medal for guilt. This means no more going back into the shop and dropping hundreds of dollars over and over again just to guilt your best medals, or even spending thousands of dollars to get guilted uh, bonus medals with insanely expensive requirements. You can see why SE might have the motive to hold off bringing this to the global version because there is no doubt in my mind at least that this will drastically change players' spending patterns and therefore force them to come up with more creative ways to entice players to spend money. So anyway, let me show you how these work. First off, there are two components to MNBs, the first of which is the full Mickey and Brooms that you see on the screen right now. And the second one is this other medal here, the single Broom Servant medal. Once you have at least five Broom Servant medals, you will be able to go to a Fantasia Mickey and tap the Evolve button to upgrade him into a full Mickey and Brooms. Since I have nine Brooms right now, and that's enough, let's go ahead and do that right now. And there's our full Mickey and Brooms. So personally, the single Broom Servant Medal is a brilliant way to let more players earn full MNBs for smaller achievements like doing weekend raids or completing easier events. Because earning full, MN full MNBs are reserved for completing higher difficulty quests or reaching the top tier in Colosseum. MNBs are also available as rewards during Lux Rankings Weeks and High Score Challenges. Plus, they're always bundled in the uh, avatar boards. So let's take a look at avatar boards. You can see that in these uh, two gold avatar boards available now, that we can pick up a full MNB plus one broom servant medal on each side. And that's in addition to the magic gem, the extra magic mirrors, and the two excellent skills all for the very reasonable price of 2,000 jewels. This is totally within reach for even free-to-play players, and I can't stress how important it is that they've made these both earnable and accessible to a lot of players in the game. Okay, on to the main event. Let's go ahead and use some of these MNBs to guilt one of my premium medals. This is the Dark Mode Riku that came guaranteed with three orbs back when I pulled him from his banner. So let's go ahead and make him stronger. I will be adding, as soon as I can find this, this uh, ability to and attack up L 100% skill. We'll overwrite his uh, guard up M or defense boost too. Let's also give him an extra chip, and then we'll throw in the three Mickey M brooms, and you can see there by the uh, flashing dots and the flashing guilt symbol that this is going to be enough for guilt. And yes, we do want to use our three star medals, and we want to overwrite the, the guard skill with the ability to two and attack up L100, but before I hit OK, quick shout out to this medal's biggest fan, Zane. This one's for you. Let's hope I get a good guilt roll. Let's go. Oh, 
Oh, that's actually pretty bad. That's on the low side because we are in campaign. This can go from 100% all the way up to 150. So 106 is pretty poor. But anyway, now of course I can uh, use magic mirrors to slowly get his percentage up higher. But I could also use another Mickey and Brooms to reroll his guilt if I wanted. That does come at a very high opportunity cost though. And in general, I don't recommend this unless you have an absolutely horrible roll. This probably qualifies. Or if you're swimming in Mickey and Brooms. It is a little bit ironic, or a lot ironic, to take one of your best weapons against RNG in this game and trade it away for another RNG roll at a chance to increase your guilt percentage by an unknown amount. It might not even go up at all. But finally, I'd also like to say that in addition to the hundreds or thousands of dollars that M&Bs can save you in the shop, there are also plenty of strategic impl implications <clears throat> Excuse me, that uh, these have on the game. Think of the deck building freedom that you can have without being at the mercy, pun intended, of what your pulls are giving you. All of a sudden you're in control of where you want to take your game and how you want to play because in a world with M&Bs, if you wanted to make a particular color setup or keyblade stronger by guilting a specific metal, you can do that. If you pulled several copies of a premium metal and you want to have a guilted copy and still have multiple 21% boosts during a high score challenge, you can do that too. And if you have more than one of the same metal and you wanted to guilt two and put different skills on them, you can do that too. So anyway, um, I hope I've given you guys a good look into M&Bs and why they're important. Personally, I can't imagine playing this game without them. And they are, to this day, one of the biggest reasons for someone to pick up the JP version of the game. At the same time, I understand that it's not going to be possible for everyone to do that, so I do hope that Mickey and Brooms do come to the NA Global version so all players can up their game and simply have more fun. Okay, and that's going to be it for this video. Happy Holidays, everyone! Thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe if you're enjoying this channel, and I'll see you guys next time.